The audiovisual department at Kaiser Hospital first got into computer video when they bought a PC equipped with a Targa video board. We started using that as a slide making package, um, and since the Targa is inherently a, a NTSC video, it was easy to just uh, drop those graphics to videotape. So we started with that, and we moved into the Macintosh platforms um, again to do graphics and slides. Um, and then just within the last year, we purchased the Amiga Toaster. With the ability to work on any platform and use all the best software, the AV people at Kaiser are able to produce state-of-the-art videos for training their staff and for educating patients. The producers here got into computers originally because they wanted to incorporate sophisticated graphics into their productions. The graphics that we've started in integrating really help um, sort of illustrate things that would be difficult to, to show on video um, because they would either be too uh, kind of bloody or gruesome or um, if they were described medically they may be too remote or um, difficult to understand to a layperson. The graphics in this video on women and HIV were created on the PC. The graphics and special effects in this tape on reconstruction surgery were done on New Tech's video toaster. The original pictures were scanned into a Macintosh and processed using Mac software. Even though Kaiser Hospital is just doing training videos, they've discovered that their patients and even the doctors expect professional quality productions. I think that um, a lot of the physicians now that, that are working with us are requesting more and more graphics because um, they, they, they see it more, I think, in their work and also just in the media in general. Um, so they're starting to understand how to use graphics, not just for their own um, um, learning, but also to help the patient. For the Computer Chronicles, I'm Maria Gabriel.